Hey everybody, this is Ernie Hatmaker, and boy, you can barely see me out here. The sun is so bright. So the peppermint did really well with the ice. Rosemary, lavender, they all did really well with the ice. The cabbage over there, the greens, the chard, eh, some of the chard kind of flopped a little bit. The tomatoes we left out that we knew were going to suffer, suffered. <laughs> There's um, sweet mint and basil in here along with the onions, and they all did okay. The greens. Um, some of the, uh, the yellow pear tomatoes kind of flopped over in there. The yellow pear tomato didn't do good with the cold. So the Queen Anne Snow Peas, they did really well in the, the frost. A lot of the weeds were killed. Uh, see some kind of big paw prints coming through here. Somebody's coyote, hunting dog, something, something with huge paw prints came through here. But the greens did good. And the Queen Anne Snow Peas, you can't even tell there was a frost with those things. This is our second frost, and I just want to show you what the pea patch and the greens are doing out here. Alright, so these collard greens are very much alive. These snow peas are very much alive. Some of the collards are bigger than others because they were secession planted. I see a hole over there, and I'm betting there's a mole in here somewhere. I better get some juicy fruit. But look. Looky here. These peas are doing really well. Good, good, good. The peas are doing well. 